some research and found out that a portion of it is belongs to rising Ebenezer. Mm -hmm. And I'll put that in the story too. Okay, this is Maurice Pitts Johnson. She's the founder of the Happy Hill um, Cemetery Friends and a longtime caretaker of the cemetery here. Um, Ms. Johnson, can you talk to me about why you've been involved with maintaining and, and keeping this cemetery cle cleaned up for over the past several decades? Well, my father took me here when I was a teenager and showed me the stones of my grandparents, Columbus Pitts and Alice Pitts, and also her mother, Matilda Simmons. Then I went away to school for nine years, and when I came back, it had become so overgrown that I couldn't find those stones. Mm -hmm. So I kept trying and struggling until I could finally find them. And of course, it took volunteers to uh, help me do that. And then I decided that uh, this is a sacred place. Mm -hmm. And so I continued to get volunteers and organizations to help to try to keep it beautified. Rising Ebenezer does help uh, keep the grass cut, but we are trying to read around the stones and trying to read close to them. Mm -hmm. and hopefully find some relatives. Okay. Uh, we have put flags at the stones of veterans, and we finally found one family that, uh, of a veteran. Now, when you say veterans, uh, they're um, young men that went off to fight in America's wars from when, from when to when? I'm guessing the first ones were maybe the Spanish-American War, 1898? World War I. Hmm? World War I? So you said World War One and World War Two and Korean veterans are buried here? World War I, I would think, because this is a very old cemetery. Okay. So, uh, and, uh, Now, you, you, you've been, you told me that in past years there have been an effort to clean up the cemetery the second and fourth uh, Saturdays of every month? Yes. Now, are you going to reinstitute re that at some point? I hope to reinstitute that, and because Mother Nature keeps working. And mm -hmm. so we have to keep working too or it will, will become overgrown again. Okay. Thank you.